Amsterdam Schiphol Airport is more than just a transit point. It's a vital artery in the network of global air travel. Handling over 62 million passengers in 2023 alone, it stands as one of Europe's busiest hubs. However, the airport's recent reputation has faced turbulence due to labor shortages and operational efficiencies. Now, with a $3 billion investment, Schiphol is set to transform through a series of ambitious construction projects. These include a state-of-the-art new pier, an innovative dual taxiway system, and a complete overhaul of passenger lounges aimed at enhancing capacity and comfort. But how do you upgrade one of the world's busiest airports with thousands of people and flights going through it each day? Amsterdam, a city renowned for its charming canals and bustling biking culture, is also home to one of Europe's most significant air travel hubs, Schiphol Airport. Established back in 1916 as a modest military airfield, Schiphol quickly transformed into a major gateway for global travelers. By 2023, it was handling over 62 million passengers annually, making it one of the busiest airports on the continent. Its success has always been tied to its strategic location and excellent connectivity, offering more than 300 direct flight routes worldwide. However, the pandemic brought unprecedented challenges. The summer of 2022 saw Schiphol grappling with severe labor shortages, leading to long security lines, frequent flight delays, and frustrated passengers. These issues culminated in Schiphol's global ranking plummeting by 14 spots. Determined to reclaim its reputation and enhance the travel experience, the airport has embarked on an ambitious $3 billion expansion project. This massive investment aims to address capacity issues, reduce congestion, and improve overall passenger comfort. Central to this project are several key initiatives, a new pier, enhanced lounge areas, and a state-of-the-art dual taxiway system. These upgrades are designed to not only increase capacity, but also modernize facilities and make the airport more eco-friendly. The construction work is happening in a live, bustling airport environment, adding a layer of complexity to the project. Nevertheless, the goal is clear – to transform Schiphol into a top-tier airport that can efficiently handle future demands while offering a seamless and pleasant experience for travelers. The construction and engineering feats involved are nothing short of remarkable and understanding them can give us a deeper appreciation for the complexity and ambition of this endeavor. One of the most significant elements of the expansion is the construction of a new pier. This addition is crucial for increasing the airport's capacity and improving passenger flow. The new pier, known as Pier A, is set to be 370 meters long and 40 meters wide, providing ample space for additional gates and amenities. The design incorporates three floors, each dedicated to different functions such as shops, security, and border control points. When completed, Pier A will offer seven new gates, four for narrow-body aircraft and three for wide-body planes. These new gates will help reduce the congestion that often plagues busy airports, ensuring smoother operations and a better experience for passengers. Sustainability is a core focus in the design and construction of Pier A. The roof and overall structure will utilize a combination of solar panels, biomaterials, and a glass facade. This eco-friendly approach reduces the airport's carbon footprint, and the use of glass allows natural light to flood the interior, creating a bright and welcoming space. In addition to the new pier, the expansion project includes the enhancement of the existing lounges. One of the main lounges, nearly 20 years old, is getting a much needed facelift. Covering over 24,000 square meters, the renovation involves redesigning and expanding the space to better serve the growing number of passengers. This includes transforming a former crew member area into an additional 5,000 square meters of space. Once complete, the lounge will feature 23 new retail, food, and drink outlets, 
offering travelers a wide range of options to relax and refresh. Renovating an operational lounge without disrupting the passenger's experience is a challenging task. The project is being executed in phases, with most of the work taking place overnight to minimize impact. This phased approach ensures that parts of the lounge remain accessible to passengers, maintaining a level of service even during construction. One of the most ambitious and technically complex parts of Schiphol Airport's expansion is the completion of the dual taxiway system. Currently, the airport is surrounded by a two-lane taxiway system designed to efficiently manage aircraft arrivals and departures. However, a critical bottleneck exists where planes must navigate a single-lane taxiway, causing backups and delays. This section's limited capacity disrupts the smooth flow of aircraft, highlighting the need for a complete dual taxiway system to ensure uninterrupted operations. The solution to this problem is the construction of a new taxiway bridge over the Air 4 motorway. This bridge, or viaduct, will complete the ring, enabling a continuous two-lane system and eliminating the single-lane bottleneck. Building a bridge capable of supporting the weight of a fully loaded aircraft is an engineering marvel requiring meticulous planning and execution. The new viaduct will be 250 meters long, 60 meters wide, and approximately 6 meters high. Its primary purpose is to carry the immense weight of the aircraft and the bridge itself, which weighs around 32 million kilograms. To support this massive weight, a robust foundation is essential. Engineers have designed a system that involves driving 900 piles deep into the ground. These piles are essential as they provide the necessary stability and support, ensuring the bridge can handle heavy loads. The construction process begins with creating the concrete foundations. This starts by making a large cast or mold that shapes the foundation. The cast is carefully positioned and then filled with reinforcements and concrete. The reinforcements, typically made of steel, provide additional strength to the concrete, making it capable of withstanding significant loads. The 900 piles driven into the ground serve as a strong foundation for the concrete platform of the viaduct. These piles penetrate deep into the earth, providing the stability and support necessary to bear the heavy loads of the aircraft and the bridge itself. The use of a large cast to form the concrete foundations ensures uniformity and strength, creating a solid base for the viaduct. To minimize disruption to traffic on the busy A4 motorway, most of the construction work is carried out at night. Temporary road closures are implemented to ensure the safety of both construction workers and motorists. This nighttime work schedule also reduces the impact on airport operations allowing the project to proceed without significant interruptions to daily activities. Aside from the major projects, the expansion includes a variety of smaller but equally important upgrades. These include revamping the existing piers, building a new baggage hall, and renewing structures like passenger walkways and bridges. All these efforts are aimed at creating a seamless and enjoyable travel experience for passengers. The expansion project at Amsterdam Schiphol Airport is not without its challenges. One of the most significant issues has been the construction of Pier A, which has faced numerous delays and complications. Originally slated for earlier completion, the project is now expected to be finished by early 2027. This extension of the timeline has primarily been due to various quality issues, repair work, and a protracted project duration. One notable problem was the damage to the fire-resistant coating on the steel beams caused by weather conditions. This damage affected approximately 18 kilometers of steel beams, necessitating the replacement of the coating and contributing to the project's extended timeline and increased costs. The total cost of constructing Pier A has escalated to 1.4 billion euros, a significant increase from the initial budget. This rise in costs is attributed to the need for repair work, delays, and an overall longer project duration. Despite these setbacks, Schiphol Airport is optimistic about meeting the new deadlines. While the project has faced significant challenges, particularly with the construction of Pier A and the new taxiway bridge, 
the dedicated efforts of engineers, contractors, and airport staff are steadily steering it towards completion. The end goal is to provide a seamless and improved travel experience for millions of passengers. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you never miss an update.